Well, thank you, Matt. Uh, meantime, 615, special guest joining us this morning, a director of track and field and cross country, Lyle Weiss. Lyle, uh, welcome to Montana this morning. Well, thank you so much for having me. It's nice to ha have you here. Let's talk about it. Uh, it's so hard to think about track season, but indoor track season is just underway. In fact, you had your, your little get together meet over the weekend. Uh, tell me about the Bobcats this year. Yeah, so we're really excited about the season. We had our first meet this past Saturday. Uh, it's really a preview of the rest of the season to come. Um, we're fortunate we have a great indoor facility. Uh, so we host a lot of home events. Um, our next home, uh, full home event will be January 11th. Um, so a little bit of a break for competition for the student athletes, but we'll get back, back at it in January. You're director of track and field uh, at Montana State University, a title you picked up in August. You've also recently assembled uh, your coaching staff as well. Tell me a little bit about the uh, new additions to the team up there. Yeah, we're really fortunate um, to have a, an incredible staff. So Tom Idle and Jennifer Allen have been at Montana State for uh, a number of years. They're both actually student athletes at one point at Montana mm -hmm. State. Uh, and Jerome Turner, uh, Jay, he goes by Jay. He, uh, yeah, he's coaching the sprints and hurdles. Uh, he's most, most recently been at the University of Akron, mm -hmm. and he's lived in the Cleveland area for most of his life. So uh, it's been a fun transition f so far for him. Uh, Whitney Henderson, she's originally from Corvallis, and she's been coaching, had been coaching at the University of Wyoming the last three years. Um, and then Dustin Seahouse is also a new staff member. So we're really fortunate to have a great staff and some new energy um, coming from different areas. That's fantastic. What's it like for you to be able to look at it now from this point of view? You're a student athlete as well. In fact, the 3,000 meter steeplechase record holder for Montana State University, right here. Yeah. I do my research now. I know these things. What's it like of coming from the athlete part now to the, the, the head coach part? What's it like following through the progress of that? Yeah, so it's been a transition um, for me. I started, you know, as, you know, doing a little bit, doing more and more, and then um, now the director of track and field. But it is, it, it's different. Uh, there's still a lot going on, so every once in a while you got to just take a step back and make sure that you're looking at the entire big picture of it and you're not just getting too close. Well, we're going to continue so. to follow the progress of uh, Montana State track and field. And Lyle Weiss joining us this morning. Thank you very much, Coach, for being here. Appreciate it very much. Thank you. We're going to take a quick break. We come back. Matt has a look. At, oh, check that. Uh, first off, we, uh, we've got a special <laughs> uh, special uh, report uh, on a little play going on at Irving. Missy, tell us a little bit about that. Uh,